Watching 13 on your side. The NBA draft just ended and with basketball on so many minds, people in Grand Rapids are using the sport to make a difference. 13 on your side's Nate Belt explains. Juliet, the Urban Youth Summer Basketball League has welcomed kids from 11 to 14 to play for more than two decades now, using the sport to mold the community's youth into better athletes and better people. Well, hoops are, of course, at the center of the Urban Youth Summer Basketball League. Changing lives and changing our environment and cleaning our environment. It's also here to help kids just be kids. The league began in 2000 under Al Rice Jr. I love everybody. I love everybody. We try to make a change in Grand Rapids. Rice wanted to make a difference in his city and chose basketball at MLK Park as the catalyst. The inner city had problems like any other city, but we finally make that um, known that this is a safe park to be. Jermaine Carter helped recruit kids to the league. I went to every park. I went to kids walking up and down the street with nothing to do. And I asked him, hey, man, y'all want to do something? Y'all play any ball? And hopes getting them off the street and onto the court will help make his hometown safer. I see kids now that they don't even get past 13, 14 years old. They're losing their lives. So we're trying to change that. City leaders are taking notice as a violent year in Grand Rapids continues on with a shooting near MLK Park killing two just Thursday morning. Police Chief Eric Winstrom is proud to see community members get involved. To see the, the adults in this neighborhood step up and put this on, uh, take the time out of their day, uh, really to for their own kids, for strangers uh, that they've never even met, and just to provide a fun and safe event for young kids, something to do, it's fantastic. Carter is proud as well and more than happy to provide. We're trying to create some for them to enjoy, some for them to come and actually have some fun and not have to think about the negative thing that's going on in our community. Tonight was just an exhibition game between former players. The league will officially begin on July 6th and last through the rest of the summer. Juliet. Nate, thank you.